Okay, so we're back. Um, so I managed to sand off all the nice uh, shiny clear coat that I once uh, put on this guitar. So basically I just uh, 2000 sanded it. Right now I'm uh, continuing to sand it. And um, like I said, basically just, you know, good old water sanding. So this and all this. Now I've gotten the whole Tiger guitar pretty much down to a matte finish all the over the place. And it's... Um, you know, have to use a leveling tool to make sure that it, it's it's uh, flat all the way across. So, um, yeah, it's all matte finished now. Now I have to buff it back out. And uh, I still got about an hour, maybe like 30 minutes left buffing all this out. But uh, as you can see, it's completely matte finish again. But uh, there's 24 ounces or so of clear coat on this guitar. So I've noticed that it made the guitar uh, two times heavier. This whole thing feels like a piece of marble now instead of a piece of wood and it's heavy uh like i said i used uh, 24 ounces of clear coat 24 12 on this body and about another half or can on that so together the guitar is just going to be super heavy this guy right here got buffed already um i completely took it from a 2000 grit matte finish to a shine again using rubbing compounds polishing glazes and then after wax so uh, that's ready but this guy Got a whole bunch more to go. Well, that's uh, maybe I'll get a part of the high speed buffing process or something. Alright.